My name's Chi. I'm overall skinny, but I do have a tummy, especially when I'm wearing the wrong pants. Today, let's look at the worst pants if you have a stomach and what to wear instead. Leather leggings, super on trend, but if you have a stomach, this look like a disaster. But I'm not asking you to completely stay away from anything faux leather. You can wear them. The key is to find the right leg shape. The best is straight leg. Just the right amount of volume and not clinging to your legs. Perfect to balance out your shape. This from my clothing line for women 5'4 and under. If you're petite, make sure you check out my clothing line at petitedressing.com for women under 5'4. Ever since I discovered like petitedressing.com, my style went from this to this. Now I'm in the game, I was on the bench, on the bench, spinning on the back like here I go again. Low rise to mid rise. I used to think low rise pants or jeans are the worst choice for women who carry weight on her stomach. But now I still think that. I did not change my mind. I want to add to that list even with mid rise. You need to be cautious. These are mid rise. They're 10 inches in rise. They're hitting right at my belly button. Problem is, for most people, your belly button is not the smallest part of your waist. Your natural waist typically are two to three inches above your belly button. So when you wear your jeans or pants right at your belly button, the mid rise, this doesn't flatter your shape if you happen to carry your weight on your stomach. Instead, go higher. Look for the jeans and pants that actually reach the smallest part on your natural waist. Wrong pleats. Here is something you probably are not paying attention to and I didn't know it until very recently. I used to be very puzzled why some of the pleated pants just didn't look right on me. Until recently, I just discovered it is because the pleats are facing the wrong direction. If your pleated pants are facing inwards are not flattering because they actually create more bulkness in your stomach and make your tummy look even bigger. So stay away from them. Look for the pleats that's facing outwards. This is the right kind of pleats that can conceal your stomach and make you look more slimmer in the midsection. Here's another type of pleated pants you need to be very careful about if they come with taper legs. Because they have taper legs and because pleats make it wider in the midsection because of what the volume from the pleats, this can make the pants look like the crotch is very low. They make it look like the crotch area is long and the crotch is hanging down, which is quite unflattering. On top of that, this is cutting into the space for the legs. So if you happen to be shorter, have shorter legs like myself, this is only gonna make your legs look even shorter. Elastic waistband. If you have a midsection concern, it's very tempting to reach for elastic waistband pants or jeans, which is very understandable. I love that too because they're so comfortable. The problem is if the elastic waistband is exposed, it's just not flattering because they can make you look frumpy and they actually can make your stomach look even more obvious. So instead, go for the elastic waistbands that is hidden. Like these pants from my clothing line. In the front, they look completely like flat panels, but in the back, you see the elastic waistbands, which is the most flattering way to get the comfort of the elastic waistband, but it doesn't make you look frumpy and looks just like regular dress pants. Flare leg pants. I know this may sound surprising to you because I love flare legs. They are one of the best leg shapes to elongate your legs, especially if you are shorter like myself. I'm 5'2". However, flare legs are designed to fit close to your body from your hips to your thighs. That means if you have a tummy, they can make it more obvious. So if you do carry weight in your stomach, you want to be selective with the flare leg pants that you're wearing. The kind of flare leg you should stay away from Number one, colors too bright or white. They will draw more attention to your stomach and make it more obvious. Change to something black or darker colors. They will elongate your legs without drawing attention to your midsection. You get the best of two worlds. And number two, clingy and stretchy fabrics. I know what you're thinking, Chi. Of course I want my fabrics to be stretchy. That's most comfortable when you have a tummy. I get that. But if they are too stretchy and too thin, they are going to be clinging to your stomach and this is like putting a magnifier on your tummy. Instead, 
Go with fabrics that has certain weight. If they have enough weight, they have enough structure, they are gonna be able to hold up its shape without completely cling to your midsection and show your stomach. Paperback pants. I mentioned this in my other videos as well, but I have to say it again here because these are really tricky. I used to love paper bags. These are two to three inches higher than regular high-waisted pants, so I thought they must be really flattering on someone with a stomach because they completely cover your midsection. What I noticed, however, is that one, they come with elastic waistbands, and two, there are extra fabrics. And these two combination just make your stomach look even bigger. What is the worst is if your paperback pants also come with a belt, and which normally they do, and this is even worse because the belt adds another layer of fabrics to your tummy, and it also draws even more attention to your stomach. Wearing the pants, that's the wrong size. This may sound obvious to you, but sometimes you might be wearing pants without realizing they are not the right size for you. It's from my own experience. I am an extra small or small for my top, so for years, I used to think I should wear the same size pants because I am an overall skinny person. But what I didn't realize because I carry weight in my midsection, I actually need to size up for my pants. So now instead of wearing extra small pants, I'm wearing small and sometimes even medium. So why you should choose the right size according to how you actually feel and how the pants actually fit on your waist instead of just looking at the numbers. If you have a stomach, it can be a challenge to find the right style for you. I know that from my own firsthand experience. Pants is just one of the things that you should pay attention to. There's a lot of other things that affect how you look, especially when you carry weight in your stomach. I do have another video, the common mistakes that we're making that actually make your stomach look even more obvious. So watch this video as well. Yeah.